Good dairy production starts early from the calf. How you take care of the calf determines future production. The prison farm may have won some awards for their cows, but they still need a lot of help in ensuring they get the most out of them. CKL Africa have taken a lead in partnering with them and have sent in Stephen Kanye, a dairy expert. Solomon, did you have any knowledge of farming before you came here? Yeah, I heard from my mother, and I also have one cow, which I get her for back home. Wow. Yes. Me, I got the career from my grandpa. Yes. And we were so little, we would go to graze together. So when you came in here and you saw the cows, how did you feel, Joseph? That's my career. I felt good. Yes. Yeah, I feel that I'm home. I'm home. <laughs> you feel at home. Yeah. And you, Solomon? That is exciting because that is the job I love. You have so much passion, both of you, about farming. Yeah. Have you observed the calves here? I've noticed that uh, the calves don't look very nice. They are brownish in color. Mm -hmm. That means that they have not taken uh, enough minerals. And also even the color also will tell you that she is not dwarfed. She has very rough hair coat. Now, some of the cows are in calf. They're almost delivering. Yeah. yeah. So, supposing you were to deliver today, the first thing that you are supposed to do is that you ensure that the cow is comfortable. Yeah. Where there is no disturbance. Then once the cow gives birth, you have to take care of that calf. Remember that this calf is the foundation of our herd. So to do that, just after the cow licks the calf, around two hours, then you take it to a calf pen, a very good calf pen that is prepared, yeah. where you have very soft beddings then you have to take the weight of that calf. Using a sack, you hang using a weighing scale. That is one. The other option would be using a weighing bird. A weighing bird is a tape which is specifically done for taking the weights of the cows and also the pigs. And to use it, you take it around the girth of that calf. And it has a side where it is indicated the kg. What are the kg for a healthy bone calf? A good calf from a very good mother yeah. should be around 30 to 40 kgs of weight. Why do you want to take the weight? One is that we have to know the amount of milk that we are going to give this calf because we usually give the milk depending on the weight. Ensure the calf suckles on the mother for the first two days to get colostrum. After that, give colostrum at 20% of the body weight in the first week. From the second week, give fresh milk at 10% of the body weight. Number two, you take the weight so that you may know the growth rate of this calf. The calf should be adding around 500 to 800 grams per day. The objective with calves should be to win early, have a developed rumen that digests well for high growth rate, and for them to come on heat at 14 months of age. Calves need a balanced diet. Give dry matter like chopped hay, avoiding fresh green fodder as that may cause diarrhea. And when the calf has diarrhea, then it loses a lot of water, which loses also a lot of energy, and you might lose this calf. The other thing that you are supposed to provide to this calf, which is around seven days, is minerals. CKL Extra Rigid will provide the cow with a lot of minerals, which is going to help this cow to have very strong bones. And the rate at which you give CKL extra rigid is from 50 grams, and you have to increase with 10 grams each and every month. You provide CKL extra rigid from seven days up to five months. Calf is also going to be immune because CKL extra rigid has diamond V. Diamond V assists this cow to develop the rumen. And when the rumen is developed very well, the calf is able to eat a lot and that leads to improved immunity. Also, this legend has lipido, which is an absorption accelerator. We want to accelerate the speed at which the food is taken in the calf's body. Also, we have uh, included three vitamins, vitamin A, D and E, and you are supposed to deworm this calf every month up to six months. You use nefluc. These are bolas. And for a calf which is one month up to five months, you use half of uh, nephruc bolus. And you know the worms pose a very great threat of anemia. 
They also deprive the calf energy, so the calf is unable to grow very healthy. The calf becomes retarded. We've learned so much on the calves, but we still remember Mr. Kinoti's cry for the cow shed that is falling apart. Not to worry, Kamau is already on the job. Oh my, this is such hard work. How does Kamau do it? There's a lot of construction to do, and Kamau has a lot of willing, helping hands, ready to learn from him as well. <laughs> the shed is looking really good. Well, I hear a train coming. It's rolling round the bend. And the train keeps rolling all down in time and town. Construction is in full swing and the cow shed is slowly taking better shape. The shed is done and is looking a whole lot better. The floor is level and smooth. There are new feeding and drinking troughs and the roof is no longer leaking. With all this new information, we hope the prison farm is on its way to better production. <laughs>